So here we go, we're headed east today. We're headed out to the Great Smoky Mountains. The producers found a nice little place, he tells me, that makes uh, wonderful homemade candy. These folks have been in business for over 50 years in Gatlinburg, right in the heart of the Smoky Mountains. And we're gonna take a little dander out there. And let me tell you, it is absolutely lashing rain. So rather than stand outside there and tell you all about it, I'm gonna do something very unprofessional and I'm gonna tell you about it now, and then I'm making a belt for it. So this place, the old smoky candy kitchen, been around forever. In fact, they tell us it might be the longest standing original store in Gatlinburg. Well, here we go. First stop, Gatlinburg. And we're here to make some candy. We're at the old Smoky Candy Kitchen. We're gonna meet my new friend, Marion King. He's been the chief candy maker here for 27 years. And he's gonna show us how to pull some taffy. Let's take a look. Marion, how you doing, buddy? Good, Good to see you. you. So you're gonna show me how to do a little taffy, to, taffy work today, huh? All right. We've already got it cooked, and we're gonna take part of this out to put on the pullers. Wow, okay, so this is, this is where we start. We just gauge how much we need and put over I see. There. So the longer it sets here, the less it sets over here. Sure, so you want to get it to a temperature that you can go to the next step. Right. That's the most important thing. And this machine then must be called a taffy puller. Taffy I'm guessing. puller. Oh, look at that. You know, every time my back gets sore, I think I'd pay somebody to put me on one of those. So this is pulling it, stretching it. Right, it gets a different feel to it after it pulls a while. It stiffens up a little. Right. How long do you pull it for? About 10 to 15 minutes. Now we need to put some flavor in it. Right. So this is the point where we make it cherry or lime or lemon right. or whatever you want. All right. So we're going to make this vanilla. Vanilla. Oh, you put it right on, oh, like that. And then the, the puller mixes it for you. Right. Oh, all right. Put in a little at a time or it'll It'll glump go up through. all in one bit. It'll go yeah. right through there. And I can see the taffy here on the end is getting that, that gummy, that pulley kind of a texture to it. And right. I notice you got a lot of other candies here. You got truffles, you got all sorts of beautiful chocolates over there. You make all those too? We've got a factory up on Ski Mountain Road that they do all the small stuff. Oh, really? We make caramel apples and red apples. We gotcha. also make fudge and, I gotcha. and divinity and other, some other things. How many little of those taffy candies do you get out of this batch? 1,200. It'll, it'll run about 80 a minute, and it takes about 15 minutes to run. Then you have to just pull it out. Oh, and it gives you a little struggle, huh? <laughs> <laughs> the more you get off, the better. Wow. So it's just did not developed an easy way to do that over the 27 years no, you've been here. No, I'm not sure. <laughs> then this is called kneading taffy. You have to knead it up, and uh, and that makes it shiny and silky. Is that the idea? Like dough? If we was going to put stripes on it, we'd put the stripes in right now. But this doesn't take stripes. We rub it with this, uh, this is a vegetable oil, and put a little cornstarch corn on it to yeah. keep it from sticking. Then we carry it over to the rollers and put her down. All right, over to the rollers. I love this machine. So this is where the taffy gets made into little candies that go through this machine and then come out as wrapped candy, right? Right. You just ease it through here. Like threading a needle. And on it goes. I see you always have a great crowd, Marion. Usually, Everybody. usually have a crowd. Yeah. You're quite the celebrity here in town. So how many times a day do you do a batch of taffy? On the weekend, we'll do about 30 some of these logs. It'd be about 450 pounds. If you don't keep it stretched Punch out it right, it, it won't wrap properly. 
Marion, what's your favorite candy? I guess my favorite is the chocolate covered cherry. Marion, you taught me the basics of taffy making. I appreciate your time. All it's right. a pleasure meeting you. We appreciate Continued you success. all coming. You want a little piece to take with I'm you? I'm going to take a little piece with me. Thank you, my friend. <laughs> For me. It's delicious. Well, there you have it. You learned how to make taffy, and I've got a little treat for the road, so let's keep on going. I gotta keep heading east. I've got a date in Cherokee. Let's go.